Hi everyone, this is Sharif here. Um, so I wanted to put together a quick video um, just to show you uh, how to evaluate your org for a lightning readiness. And this will be the first, um, the first of you know many posts on classic to lightning, just documenting the different um, different features of lightning and how to convert from classic going into lightning. Um, so this is uh, fairly uh, simple. When you log into your org, I'm logged into my developer org here, if you click on setup, on the left hand side here you'll see this lightning experience link. And when you click on it, it'll bring you to this lightning experience migration assistant. And you see here there's a bunch of videos and uh, ways to evaluate. Okay. Um, so the first thing you want to do here is check your lightning experience readiness and click evaluate here this will ask you to log in um, so since I'm already logged in I'm just going to click allow and it's evaluating so once the evaluation is done you're gonna get your um, you're gonna get the evaluation in your mail so um, so now I'm in my email, I logged in, and as you see, you get an email here um, to review a report. And when I click on the PDF version here, so this gives you information about the features that are ready. So as you see here, custom buttons and links, homepage, email templates, lookup filters, these are all ready to go. Um, here are some of the things that need some work. So the documents, forecast, order, okay. Um, so as you go down here, it, it, it spells out all of the different um, areas uh, that may work or that may have some kind of conflict cases. So this gives you a detailed report of what you have to look out for as an admin and um, really try to remedy um, before you go live with the Lightning experience. Now going back here, so we've done the evaluation. Um, you also have other options here. So you can compare the features. Um, you can preview your org and the Lightning experience. Um, you can uh, do the trailhead trail here by clicking on start trail. And then some other options that you can enable, um, you know, within Lightning. You can also decide as far as the profiles and select users that can use Lightning. And then finally, you can enable the Lightning experience. So this is uh, just a quick walkthrough of how to get to this page, which is very, uh, very useful in figuring out uh, your next steps in migrating over to Lightning. Thank you.